And this is how it all began with one pioneer woman spatula. The pioneer woman obsession got started when I needed this to ice in my cake. Always seen it in the store, but never wanted to buy it until I needed it. This thing was $7. Seven dollars I'm talking to you. It was seven dollars. Then it led to my obsession of these canisters, these oven mitts. I love the oven mitts. They nice. Got a good grip in it, and they washable, and wash up pretty good too. And then pots and pans several of them spoon rest so pretty then I picked up these babies today with the what that bird is again hummingbird pattern on it set of three nesting bowl set with lids I got some of those already but a different pattern and then I got another baker set also with the hummingbirds on it and the one inside got the hummingbirds then I have over here another set a baker baker set with that flower pattern and then the biggest one like a 9 by 13 and I don't know what size this is but it is this is a um focus 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 I still can't see it but anyway it's a stoneware you can bake um uh, your food inside the oven with it and then here are my stoneware canisters for potatoes, onion, fresh onion, and that one say fresh garlic. Then I have an oven mitt set here that I've never used. I had intentions to use it, but I never used it. Let me turn them around a little bit. There you go. And that is the vintage floral pattern. And this here is a berry colander. Rinse your berries off with a little drain plate saucer. And then picked up these guys here caught the most clearance for one dollar and they were regular four dollars a glass but I got them for a dollar each and then the other utensils that I got I need to get some more because I always find myself running out and here a set of her knives here. This was the clearance uh, special that came in. Um, I think this was the um, the Black Friday sale. When Black Friday sale, it was a knife set that came with these little plastic cutting boards here. I can't move it right now because it'll fall. And then. I got these little utensil holders. Say utensil on the front. Let me show you on this one right here. You can see it better. Oops. And then I got some spatulas by her. A cheese grater. And it grate real good too with the little protective plastic cover. Another can opener, and I say another because 
Somebody keep opening up giant peaches. I mean, put them things on. Mandarin oranges and tearing it up. And oh, that's the first one right there. But I got another one over here. Oh, let me show you these two. This is her little one of her dogs, uh, Ree. This is her dog. And that's one of her towels there. And I got some towels here. And then over here, I got that little teapot, salt and pepper shaker, vintage floral plates here. Then I have some more pots and pans of hers too. She got good cookware, so y'all need some cookware. Consider getting you some Pioneer Woman cookware. Because they cook up really, really good. And this is the, um, what is it, nonstick skillet here. Half of the time I forgot I have them. I don't even use them, really. The rest is in there, those blue handles. I'm not gonna pull them out, but they are Pioneer Woman. And over here, I have her um, rolling pin and flour, sugar, and meal canisters, a butter dish. And these are some dry measure cups here with different patterns on them. Actually, I just chipped that one not long ago, but it's okay, I'll get another set. And they all have a different pattern. That's what I love about her stuff. Everything is different, nothing is the same. Hurry up because my battery is dying. And then these are her um, liquid measuring cups here. And I got two coffee bugs here on the side of that. And I have two sets of measuring spoons. I have that pattern there. One pattern came with a um, pot and pan set. And I have that pattern right there. And also today, I picked, well actually I have two of these sets here. I have one in the cabinet, the bakeware. I have two of those, two sets of these, and one set of this beautiful oval set. Ain't that pretty? I have this glass cutting board that she just came out with and it is so pretty so pretty I love that pattern isn't that gorgeous just got it today and what else of hers do I have oh and I lined my uh, cabinet with her uh, contact paper too I love that and I think okay and then I brought it on to my laundry room room area too she have uh, some stuff for your laundry little storage baskets I bought that to put my stuff in for work and it works out good I like it overlook that noise it's my charger i keep bumping everything so i accented my wall with this little cow picture that i got from hobby lobby and that one over there and this is her table runner and yeah so if you're thinking about getting a good cookware set Consider power in your woman, you will like it. Oh, did I show you this measuring, big, huge measuring cup? It is so pretty. She got measures on the inside of the cup. 
And let me show you this right here. I have these. And that big uh, colander and her pie dish. Awesome. Let me put that down. See that pie dish? Isn't that pretty? I have two sets of these here because I do a lot of storage after I cook. And then this pretty sifter. It's so pretty. I love it. And that's my second set. And that's my first one right there. Well, I got two sets of these, one set of those, and my brand new one that I bought today, and my brand new uh, storage that I bought today. So, if you're looking for Pioneer Woman, go to your local Walmart, and most of these items may be available in your store. I'll talk to you late, guys later. Bye! These are mixing bowls. Um, I don't know what the name of that pattern, but the screen. And then you have the vintage floor. And these are like little placemats that I use for hot pads and placemats. Oh, and these cookie jars, well, storage jars, I use them for treats, coffees, and stuff like that. I got these at a great deal for $5 each. They got marked down from like $9 or something to 5 bucks.